I think Skyblock at its core is the ultimate challenge in resource management. You spawn on a tiny island in an empty universe. All you have is a tree, some supplies, and some dirt to stand on. You have to treasure every dirt block because if one falls into the void, there's no way to replace it. And as you carefully navigate your absurd circumstance, you gain a new appreciation for the few things you have as you meticulously use them to their fullest effect. With nothing but some ice, lava, and saplings, you slowly transform this empty expanse into a world of your very own. Skyblock teaches us that no matter how ridiculous the odds may seem, within us resides the power to overcome these challenges and achieve something beautiful. That one day, we'll look back at where we started and be amazed by how far we've come. Hello. My name is the Phoenix Boy. Depending if this actually gets that many views, many of you might not know me. But I was a huge fan of Technoblade. If my memory serves me right, I found him right about when the second Potato War had come out, right before my birthday. It was one of the only things I could enjoy back then because of the pandemic, and it helped me get through those hard times. After that, I watched his first Hypixel Skyblock video. Man, that intro hits different nowadays. Anyway, that is and was still one of the funniest things I've ever seen in my life. This man was the comedy king he knew how to make everyone laugh and that is an aspect that i'll forever miss i remember watching his bed wars videos and aspiring to become as good as him one day i still haven't and seeing his skyblock videos and wondering how is he that good at this game how could i become better technoblade is what made me come back to minecraft before i found him i had nothing to play ever i sucked at all the games that came out at that time but now i can enjoy things I can play games I love. I can watch things that I love. For the first time in a while, I was happy. When I had first heard about it, I had just woken up from a 17 hour nap that I clearly really needed. My friend had messaged me, but of course I didn't respond. After I woke up, she told me the news, but I insisted that she was lying. She wasn't. I, I felt this shock. One that I've never felt before. I couldn't believe it. This couldn't be happening. I cried for so long. I immediately went on to Minecraft and built something for him. That was, and still is, one of the hardest days of my life. It's still hard writing this right now. One thing that I realize now is that through all of it, he never stopped being Technoblade. Even when passing away, he wanted to go by making everyone smile. His last merch piece includes a shirt. That says GG Easy. It's amazing. I built something in Skyblock for him. It should be on screen after this. I spent hours making this just for him. I think honestly he would like it. Technoblade, he will carry on your legacy and you will not be forgotten. Legends are never forgotten. Through all of this, we must remember Technoblade never dies in our hearts.